What's happening, everybody? This is the Big Jew, and welcome back to Final Fantasy IV: The After Years. All right. Last episode, we got all the small tales in the overworld. There's uh, some more small tales we can get, but for now, I want to take a break from getting all the small tales to uh, see what's going on in this world. See what's going on, and uh, see if we can get the uh, summons. Uh, that's kind of uh, how the game directs you to go about doing things. Um, yeah, it's pretty non-linear. Uh, Pretty much you just gotta go to every village and see what's going on. So let's go to Mist first. Yeah. By the way, I forgot to mention, check out the party I have. Does it not remind you of another four player party that you had when you had the airship and it was like pretty much free roaming? Yeah, you got, you know, you got. You know, you have, uh, you have, you have Edge, which is like a replacement for Yong, Luca, which is a replacement for Sid. You know, you got Golbez, who's obviously a replacement for Cecil, and then you got your Mage and Rydia. So that's pretty cool. I like how they did that. Yeah. Hold on. Let me, uh, change the zoom. There we go. This way, uh, just looks better. Let's go to Mist first. Yeah, why not? Sorry about that. If the camera shakes a little bit, it's because I'm itching everywhere. I left some, uh, I left some open, uh, I, I left some fruit punch, uh, at my desk, and, uh, yeah, huh. Let's just say, as when I got home, ants everywhere, so, yeah. I guess pretty as mom is, uh. Protecting this place from, uh, monsters. Yes, that's what we have to do. We have to free the Eidolons. Yeah. Sweet. Alright then. That's right. Somebody call her mama. Yeah. And we can explore around here a little bit. Let's do that. Why not? We can get the same stuff as we always could in every visit to Mist. Get bomb cranks and good stuff like that. You can't buy any items, you can't go to Rydia's place. So I wouldn't even bother, like, worrying about that kind of stuff. There's Rydia's mom's grave. Yeah. Everyone's pretty much hiding while Rydia's mom, uh, is using the last of her power as a summoned monster to, uh, to, sorry. To protect the village from monsters and stuff like that. But yeah, like she said, we have to free the idol. We have to free the idol ones. The first one I want to free is the Sylph. So to do that, we have to go to Capo. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, you're gonna go to every place in order of the original game, more or less, with the exception of like Damsian and stuff like that. Yeah. Look, there's Sylphs here. What the hell? Yeah, but they're evil. You talk to them, they will fight you. So, yeah. Yeah, damn. Yeah, that's crazy. And you get some cutscenes here. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, yeah. Uh-oh. What's going on here? Oh, it's Tell and Anna. And Golbez is like... <laughs> I like how this game just doesn't. I like how the. Ah, I like how this game just doesn't give away Golbez's identity, even though you may have not played in his tale. I mean, you know, he just kind of uh, acts surprised. You can buy some lame weapons and stuff here if you need to, but you shouldn't need to at all. <laughs> They don't disadvantage you that much in uh, if you start the uh, final chapter without doing any of the other chapters. No, they, they give you, they yeah, they give you piss poor equipment, but I mean, you can still defend yourselves. Really? Damn, that's crazy. Oh yeah. Yeah, they're talking about Harley, so... Wait a minute, is this Yong? It is Yong! 
Jesus Christ, how are you still talking, buddy? Damn. So you can get hit by a Leviathan, and, she, and he's just like, Ursula, help my daughter. Yeah, right, tell me about it. We don't even have cure magic. I mean, we do. I mean, Edge has, uh, what do you call it? What do you call it? A uh, heal pill. But... So we need to pretty much help these guys. So to do that, oh yes, you know where we're going. This makes you think back to the original Final, Fa Final Fantasy IV. What did you do in the original Final Fantasy IV to help Yong when he was unconscious in that game? That's right, you hit him with the frying pan of love, and that's what we gotta do to recover him. To recover him? Yeah. To, to make him recover from this specific condition. So, let's do that. And head to Fabul. Well, let's head to Damson first. Yeah. Yeah, I like how this game kind of forces you to take the path of the uh, clat of the original. Or it doesn't really force you to take that path, but, I mean, you may as well. So there's Damsian. And of course, we gotta... What was it? We gotta raid the uh, treasury. You know, uh, the obligatory treasury raid. We got some decent stuff here. Yeah. Stuff, you know, red, right, blue fangs, pretty decent stuff there. We got diamond shield. I'm gonna be equipping that on a uh, gold. Oh, well, maybe I shouldn't equip it on Golbez. <laughs> and yeah, and then and, and Luca has the uh, Gaia hammer. That's right. You can get some. You can get a better hammer or a better uh, weapon for uh, Luca. I mean, all you had to do it was just unequip the Sid in a uh, Kane's tail if you got the Ogre Killer in that tale, but you can also, uh, you can get an ogre killer in this chapter as well, and I'm gonna be doing that later, but not now, so, yeah. It's quiet. Too quiet. What? Ant lions? What the hell are these guys doing here? Jeez. I guess. It's like crawled out of the, uh, ant lions den, they're like, let's take over Damsian because... Because of the moon, pretty much, yeah. Maybe they won't attack if we just don't talk to them? Yeah, pretty much. If you talk if you talk to these uh if you talk to the ant lions they'll uh you'll fight one. So don't talk to any of the ant lions. Simple as that. Let's do some exploring here while we're at it. I do want to get something very important here. That's Harley's diary. You can get a small tail in Harley's room, so there we go. Yeah. Oh, I guess you can't read Harley's diary. Maybe she took it with her, I don't know. Where is Harley, anyways? Maybe she's here, who knows? Yeah. You can get some treasures here, nice. Let's get a decoy, lame. Oh, that's right, yeah, we got a. Enter through this and make it extra annoying. Thanks, game. Got a bomb core. Weak. That is weak sauce. Oh well. Hmm. Let's go all back in the game again. That was the third damn time. Sweet mother of mercy. And nothing there. Okay. I thought there was a small tail there, but apparently not. So. Yeah, and uh, I highly suggest you get all 21 small tails before, well, you'll see, before entering Baron. Because that'll be like a point of no return thing. Yeah. As if that's a spoiler, of course we're going to be going on the moon. What, Harley's here? How could she get back here? Well, she did get back here, that's right. Yeah, because after Edward's chapter ended... He joined uh, Seodor, if you don't remember. Yeah. Gobez is like, I have nothing to do with this. I don't know what you're talking about. I didn't raid them back in the day. I don't know what you're talking about. No, that did not happen. Did not happen. No. <laughs> Oh, 
<laughs> Edge. We don't need any clerical work. That's pretty much all that Harley's ever good for. I mean, granted, you you can kind of uh, make her into a, a pr you can kind of make her into a uh, fighter later on in the game if you give her like different stuff. But for the most part, she's pretty useless. I mean, she has Guild Toss, which the damage of that will increase with your level. But even if Harley's at a disgustingly high level, it doesn't matter. It really doesn't make any damn difference at all. So I'm not going to use her. She's not probably not going to get any screen time. I'm, I'm completely honest about that right now. So if you're a big Harley fan, if you, if you, like, if you like the hot secretaries... Then, uh, sorry, go, go watch some porn or something. I don't, I don't know what to tell you, okay? Anyways, let's head into Fabul. Yeah. Shut up, Krillin. <laughs> I, would do Kr I would do Krillin's voice, but... I don't know how to do it anymore. I used to be able to do it. I'm not talking about the, uh... I'm talking about the English dub that, uh... Damn. Alright, if, anyone, if anyone's watched Dragon Ball Z, I'm talking about the English dub that was made, like, before 1999. Because the English dub after 1999 was just awful. Yeah. Back when it was on Cartoon Network, I mean. Yeah. Yeah, please, go right ahead. No, it's, uh, that's the, uh, current dub of, uh, Krill in there. I can't, I can't do it anymore, I'm sorry. Yep, lame items here. You can get claws if you want, but claws aren't really that great anymore, to be quite honest. If anything, I'm gonna probably just sell them all for money. Alright, so, you know where we need to go here. I'm just gonna get all the uh, items off screen. I mean, there, are, there is a small tail you can get here, and I'm going to be getting it, but I really want to just wake up young and get, uh, and get the sylph. Yep, more flashbacks. Right? Oh, no, never mind. They're just doing a discussion thing. Discussion cutscene. That is true. Yep. Young and Ursula friggin' rock in this game. Yep, and as you said get the frying pan of love and we get a ladle of love to uh I guess to hit Ursula with wow Edge really what do you mean no knife this time doesn't matter your throw your throw command is nerfed beyond repair in this game Edge yeah I'm gonna get items later on for now I wanna go to uh capo Ooh, excuse me. Sorry about that, I just needed to stretch a little bit. Let's go ahead and launch this thing. And hit the capo. Yeah. Whoops, went too far. I think so. Let's see. And if, if by chance you get lost, you can use the sight spell. <laughs> Actually, you can't, no. You would have to buy some gnomish bread and use that. Uh, get into a fight with... Oh, the goblin captains. I should have fought them. Yeah, goblin captains give you excellent XP, like they always did. And they're mad easy to beat, too. So, yeah. I want to try and keep the length of this video under 20 minutes. The last one was very long, and I don't like doing long-ass videos like that. Alright, let's do this. Sup, Young? Edge is like, I'll take, I'll handle this. I was always jealous of him because he had way more strength than me. Alright. Where is it? Oh, by the way, 8 adamantite, like I said before. Let's see, done. Yeah, so. Where is this damn thing? Jesus Christ. It's like all the way on the bottom. We'll be like, what are you doing? Boom! 
Wow. That's hardcore right there. Should use a cookie sheet. That would be more like uh, extreme championship wrestling. Or a cheese grater. No, that, that's not. He's like, I don't care about me. I care about Ursula. And I care about Ursula too because Ursula is a little bit better than Yong in this game. Especially in this final chapter. You got Chakra, which is nice. And then you got... And, and Tenketsu... And Tenketsu is amazing. Yeah. Alright, here you go. <laughs> I like the sound effect in the Wii version a little bit better. In my opinion. <laughs> wow. Good God. And Luca's like... Luca's like, what did I just watch? <laughs> and Golbez is like... This is insane. And here are the sylphs, yeah. Yeah. Pretty much. All you can do is just recover hit points. And you're not even bugged in this game. But sylph is pretty damn good, and, uh... It's gonna be a pretty good... It's gonna be a more efficient way to recover uh, hit points of your players. Alright, so that about does it for this. Uh, yeah, well, never mind. Let's get all this done. There we go. Yep. Pretty much. I said this wouldn't last so long, and now it's lasting like friggin' 17 minutes. Awesome. Yeah, we just gotta rescue all the Eidolans. Pretty much. Yep. Let's get moving. Absolutely. Have Dong join the party. Nah, the, the, these players don't join your party yet. They will, but not yet. So. Alright. So, what other islands am, am I going to be saving? Ooh, what's this? Yeah, for every idol and we, f for every idol and we free, we get a cutscene. But what's actually going to be hap What's actually going on in Baron Castle? Is Cecil actually possessed by the mysterious girl? Find out next time on Final Fantasy IV: The After Years. This is the Big Jew telling you to keep being awesome. Peace.